everybody, it's Emily Rosalie. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm filming my September favorites and I've got this fall inspired makeup look using my ColourPop Orange You Glad. I can't put this in my favorites because this is the first time that I've used it. Um, but I will link that video up in the top. So the first favorite is my Physician's Formula Butter Bronzer. I love this. It's gorgeous. It smells like vacation. <laughs> Which is nice if you're, you know, you're going to start getting your fall blues and you're going to miss the sunshine. But it's a really nice shade and it doesn't look orangey or even too cool on my pale skin. And it's buildable so it would work on darker skins also. Oh, oh, dropping it, dropping it. <laughs> so even though it's my first time using the Orange You Glad palette from the haul, I actually filmed that haul about a month ago, so the other products that were in that haul I have been using, and another one of my September favorites is this lip gloss, Here's to You. It is so beautiful. It smells like vanilla cupcakes, and it's got all kinds of different color sparkles in it, and it just looks really lovely. In fact, maybe I can put it on for you right now. Here's a little swatcheroony. So I love that. Another favorite has been some of the solid perfumes that I used in my perfume review video as a healthier alternative to commercial fragrance. <laughs> Did you hear him? And he's running around like crazy in the background. And my little setup is right near the kitchen that has like laminate flooring and he's just running around and he just like slid like into first base. <laughs> anyway, the solid perfume that I got on the Etsy shop, Soap Works. I'm not sponsored to anything. I got them with my own money and I really like them a lot. And I actually ordered some more. Uh, so maybe I'll do another one of those reviews and, and see what those ones are like also. The next favorite is this tinted lip balm from Pacifica in the color Blood Orange. It is so beautiful and I love this because whenever I wear lipstick and I kiss my boyfriend, it comes off on him, it gets off of me, it's a uh, not fun for anybody but sometimes lipsticks and things can be really drying so I love this I know I didn't swatch it that well it's a little difficult to swatch but it's really moisturizing it smells really really amazing it smells like blood orange so I can be wearing something on my lips that you know tints a little bit so I don't look like a corpse and don't have to worry about transferring it next favorite is this NYX doll eyes mascara I really like this. I have a hard time finding mascara that doesn't um, end up, you know, smearing on my lower lash line at the end of the day or even, not even at the end of the day. And um, this one has been really nice. It gives me some length and volume and it really stays in place and I just like it a lot. The next favorite is one I've been using a lot and that is this NYX blush in Dusty Rose. I'm wearing it right now. And it doesn't really, I don't know, it's not super dusty. I've seen other colors called Dusty Rose. It's pretty rosy. It's matte, it blends really well, and it's just lovely. Another thing that I'm wearing today is the Milani Highlighter and Strobe Light. And I like this a lot. I think it's really lovely. It has uh, a slightly pink undertone to it. It's very pigmented and you don't need a lot. And and a little bit goes a long way, as you may have seen in my other video. <laughs> Oops. Um, I got a lot on my brush, you guys. This might, this might be, uh... Oh! Kabling. So the last favorite is a food item, and that is the Jackson's Honest Sweet Potato Chips. And I'm pretty sure that it only has three ingredients. I think it just has uh, sweet potatoes, salt, and coconut oil. And I actually went on a hunt to find a bag to show you, and I don't have any. So I'm gonna need to order those, like, right now. <laughs> so the fails. <sighs> Yee. So I had a couple of hard fails this month, and one of them is so sad. 
So this is the first time that I've tried anything from this brand, uh, Lily Lolo. And I was so excited about it because they're cruelty free, they're clean beauty, and I was so ready to love it. And um, this is another thing that you may have seen if you saw my other tutorial where I was trying it on and it had no coverage at all. It looked like it was going to be too pale, but it just had no coverage. It was like a moisturizer, but it wasn't even a good moisturizer because it pilled up underneath my foundation because I hadn't planned on putting foundation on top of it, but I had to because it didn't have any coverage. It had a, a lovely scent to it. It was actually a very enjoyable scent, but um, I'm pretty sure that it caused me a lot of irritation after I used it. It had like a pepperminty scent and it was um, pleasantly tingly, but um, most of the time when things are giving you that pleasant, uh, tingly feeling, they're not what you think, you know? Like a lot of people think, oh, it's doing something, it's getting in there. But um, most of the time it's actually just irritating your skin and that's what happened with this, so. I'm super sad. So this next fail might be a little bit controversial because I'm sure a lot of people love it. It's the NYX liquid liner and this failed on me so hard. It it has a really soft uh, tip to it so it's really difficult to get a straight line and I struggled with it a lot. And I'll show you a comparison to my favorite liquid liner. This one is the Milani one in my right hand, and this one is the NYX one. And let's see. You can see that the tip on the right one is a lot longer, which makes it a lot smoother. And it's stiffer, so you can get a much straighter line. Uh, let's move on to the next one and pretend that didn't happen. <laughs> So I wanted to give you a proper introduction of my sweet girl, Leia. She's a lot more camera shy, but she's so sweet and cuddly and she's definitely my therapy cat. She's my little angel. Hopefully next time she won't be distracted by Indy and she'll let me hold her for a little bit longer in front of the camera. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. It helps me a lot. It does some friend thing with the algorithm. Subscribe and hit that bell so you never miss a video. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day.